625 now welcome back today happens to be national nacho day so we are celebrating with not just nachos we are celebrating with ultimate nachos <laughs> kelly odell here with us to show us how to make them she's the marketing manager for salsaritas fresh cantina the mexican restaurant chain based right here in charlotte all right so tell us how do we get started all right first we've got our big mound of chips which we mound of chips is always oh, a good thing right? first thing in the morning can't go wrong so, and then we're gonna start off with our beans if you're a big fan of black beans. I was gonna say, talk about our spread here because we've got quite the spread because these are ultimate nachos after all. Right, so this right here is not a representation of all of our toppings because we have a whole bunch. This is our typical ultimate nachos, what the average guest would get. We brought our chicken, but we've got steak and shrimp and ground beef and I got you, pork. so from left to right on the screen, we've got chicken, then we've got cheese down on the bottom. Queso, yeah. Queso, onions. Black olives. olives, our pico de gallo, which we make fresh daily as well, guacamole, jalapenos, and some cilantro. And the great thing about nachos is you can put anything on them. Anything you want. Some people don't get queso. Those people are not a fan in my book because the queso really All makes right, the <laughs> nachos. I'm going to make mine. You're going to make yours? Yep. Okay. Whatever you like. I'm going to put some salsa. And I'm going to start like with salsa. some beans. And then some guac. I've become like a big guac fan. Yeah, that's what salsa is the best because guacamole, free on any entree you want. Oh, as even, much as you want. Even better. All right, free is always I good. A, I think that's a dig in another chain. I'm not sure, but I think <laughs> uh, it might be. A little bit. <laughs> it might be. All right, perfect. We're going to continue to fix this during the break. I think everybody else is going to probably come up and start sampling. Um, they're going to. I hope like so. Ravenous beast coming over here. <laughs> Uh, listen, thank you for coming on. We certainly appreciate it. We're going to celebrate National Nacho Day here for breakfast. This recipe and deals you can get for National Nacho Day is going to be on our website, wcnc.com.